What's going on guys, Box Candies here, and welcome back to another episode of the Village SMP. This is episode 3, last episode we were working on our cow farm, uh, and I've done a bit of work on this place since last episode. Uh, the server was down for a few days, so I haven't been able to really uh, get on, but uh, I've extended it, I've put the, the floor and the walls down, uh, I just need to get the animal in here now. Uh, which I think, this one I want it to be sheep. I think I think I need sheep just so I can have the wool, um, because I would like to use wool for uh, multiple builds and whatnot. So we need to go find some sheep. Uh, I'll do that off camera though. Uh, this is growing in nice. I need I still need to uh, expand this place and uh, put down all the you know the the spruce wood and the stone brick and whatnot. But that is not what we're doing this episode. I gotta see. Okay, good, that tree's grown. Uh, is there any... Where would I even find sheep? I mean, sheep... I feel like I've killed all the sheep. Or no. Wait, actually, there's there's usually sheep up in the extreme hills. I feel like that's where they're found the most. Um, but this episode, anyways, I want to... I want to I wanna work on a chest room. Uh, I don't have a storage room at all yet, except for like the little thing that's in my bedroom down in the base. Uh, and I really need to start getting organized with all my stuff because I'm running out of room as of now and I don't want to add more chests in here. So I only have these four chests right now. <laughs> I'll probably have to add more before uh, the chest room is done. But then after I get the chest room done, I can start uh, moving stuff uh, and organizing stuff, which will be super nice. And then we'll feel a lot better. I'll feel a lot better about myself. Uh, so the chest room, anyways, is going to be right here. Um, I started working on this earlier, and as I was working on this this chest room, my power went out. I was I was like digging right here, and then boop, black everything black. Uh, it was it was storming at the time, obviously, and my power just, it was it was down for like four or five hours, maybe even longer. Uh, and I just got back on. Because uh, I wanted to continue working on this stuff, I need to get chest room done, uh, and I need to get—I want to get an episode of Village out. So, here we are. Uh, I'm planning on finishing the chest room this episode. It should be pretty simple, I would think. I do want to make it nice and nice and cozy, though, like all the other rooms. Probably the same material as well. Uh, spruce wood. Wait, yeah, spruce wood and uh, stone brick, probably. So like the same style as you know the other rooms that I've had. <laughs> you you guys know. Uh, I don't know how big I'm gonna need it. I feel like I want to kind of have it like a decent size, um, because I want to have a million chests in here. I want to have a million chests in here, so I never have to make another chest basically for this area. Now in the future. After I get done with this cave base and whatnot, I do plan on doing other projects on the server, such, you know, just building big buildings and whatnot, just other projects somewhere else on the server, since we're fairly close to spawn anyways right now. Because, uh, I think we all agreed that we wanted our first build to be uh, a bit closer to everyone. But anything after that, we can go wherever we want. So, uh, after we get done with this... We will be moving on to something else. I don't have any ideas of what I want to do for my first project, but we will find that out later on. Uh, so yeah, let's get started on this. Uh, I have to decide how far back I want it. So for right now, actually, oh, also, I forget you can put chests right next to each other now. That was That's probably like the best thing that they've ever added into Minecraft, honestly. Because uh, I used to have to put... Uh, trapped chests next to each other so that I could, you know, put chests next to each other and whatnot. Um, but now we can put chests, actually, like any chest next to each other, which is awesome. I am i don't know why they didn't have that, like, I don't know why that was ever not a thing. Why was, <laughs> why did you have to have a space between chests in the first place at all? I really, I don't know. But it's changed now. It's a lot better. So, I don't know. <sighs> I don't know if I want chests on this. So it's going to go obviously filling this wall, chest filling this wall, and chest filling the back wall. And then this side as well. I don't know about this right here. This little thing. Probably 
Honestly, I mean, it's just, it, it's a room forge. It's a storage room. Uh, I don't want the ceiling to be as high as the uh, the farm, though. See, I have it all the way up there. It'll probably be up to, like, right here, I think. Yeah, to right there is probably good. So we're not going all the way up, but a decent amount. So is that is that it? Can't see. I think that's it. Five up. Is that what I was talking about? Yep, okay. Cool, so then that's the height. Um, I just need to decide how big I want it. All right, so it actually took uh, <laughs> a lot less longer than I thought it would take uh, to get like a good size that I I liked and whatnot. So here it is. This will be the chest room. It's big enough. It really is. I'll have chests coming up to here. One, two, three, four. Or maybe here, one, two, three, four. And then I'll leave this and then start chests here. So I just cut down uh, the big tree outside. So I get a bunch of wood because I need all of the wood I can get to make chests. We're gonna make a million chests right now. That is my plan. Do I have any more wood? Can make chests out of those two. Is this faster? I've, I've never really used this. How do I? The chest be under here. I have to click. I don't know if that's quicker or not. I've, like I said, I've never really used the the recipe book at all. Um, because no, it is quicker. I think. I actually do think it's quicker. I wish I could just hold it down, but I can't. I've, I actually have to click myself, um, and we're just going to make all the chests that we can. It's it's faster than me having to drag it, I think, so. Okay, recipe book, you did your part. Now get out of my sight. Um, so since that took so, since that was really fast, I think I might also work on uh, this farm as well, uh, expanding it. Oh, the thing is, I'm trying to think. I might want to like completely redo this place, like take out this little farm, because I I have like a better idea of how I want those farms set up. Uh, because I I want multiple things in there: potatoes and wheat, sugarcane, everything that I can plant in there. I want in there. Um, and I've, I I think I have a better idea of how I want that set up. Ah. That's not good. I have an idea, though. It's okay. I'm going to come in clutch right now. Watch this. Ready? Watch how clutch I come in. There we go. <laughs> that looks a little bit better, I guess. <laughs> Oops. That looks better. Nice. <laughs> Saved. Look how many chests that took up just to get around the whole place. So basically back here, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to put like uh, some stone brick with some glowstone in, in, in between so I can get some light, uh, some better light instead of the torches. Uh, so that's what I was leaving the corners out. Uh, but I guess we can just try for another row now. Uh, we're not going to be able to finish another row. But, oh gosh. I thought I just put my... <laughs> Axe in there. Close. Oh, we're missing three chests. Which we don't have. Uh, I need more light in here. For now. I don't think I'll build up to the stone bricks, so. Okay. Nice. Well, we have a chest room. Uh, the next thing I need to do is get um, item frames, which I can just go ahead and kill my cows. Soon, uh, I don't know if I want to breed them more before I kill them. I do need food, though. Does that mean this seems like a lot? There's still babies in there. Can't tell if there's babies in there or not. I don't think there is. So I could take them out now, make a bunch of item frames, so I can label the chests, and I could start moving stuff over, and then we can... Then I'll be happy, basically. So I'm going to need like a full row of chests dedicated for cobblestone. 
since I'm living in, like, doing my cave thing, like, this whole cave, digging everything out, I, I'm going to have a ton of cobblestone. So, I'm just going to take one of these rows right here, and I'm just going to throw it, throw all my cobblestone in there. Uh, that's my plan, I think. But, we should, let's just go ahead and kill the cows. Kill the cows all except for two. I wish I had a looting three sword. That'd be awesome. In the future, we'll have one. I'm gonna end up breaking my sword, aren't I? I'm glad they added the uh, AOE damage. This should also get me to level 30. We might go ahead and enchant another pickaxe, I think. Because I do need a fortune... Like, a fortune 3 pickaxe is what I need ASAP. Because I want to get a ton of diamonds. I want to get really rich on the server, obviously. Get a ton of diamonds. And just be set on all armor and tools. God, why is this take... Okay. There we go. All but two. Now we have a ton of food. So we're going to be set on food forever. And a ton of leather. Which I'm thinking maybe I should keep the leather. And not make item frames right now. Maybe I should just do signs. I, I, I'm i thinking I want to keep the leather just because I want to make my full enchantment room eventually. And if, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have eight furnaces now, by the way. It's really nice. Um, so I'm thinking maybe we should just do signs to label. I usually always do uh, item frames, but... I want my full enchantment room, so I don't have to keep using uh, rock stars. Okay, let's go enchant an another pickaxe. We just hit level 30, so let us do that. It's like the last two sticks I have. Let's sleep really quickly, so we don't go blowing anything up. Rise and shine. Oh, I kind of want to bring some food. There we go. That's enough. Okay, let's go enchant another pickaxe, and hopefully we could get a fortune three. That would save me so much, guys. It really would. Uh, I'm just I'm gonna repair this uh, this work pick as well. Soon I'll repair it once it gets really low. But that'll be a work pick for a while. I know it does get expensive eventually, but for now it should work. Brandon. I get tea. I'm going to use your enchantment table again. Which is right here. Ooh, baby. That's what I like to see, guys. That is what I like to see. Exactly what I needed. Could have used some uh, Unbreaking 3 on it. I would have really liked Unbreaking 3 on it. But we got our Fortune 3 pick. Diamonds will, are going to start flowing to us, guys. They're going to start... Oh, I didn't get my saplings. Three plant. Oh, okay. Well, I think I still have more. <laughs> but we are going to start getting rich here soon. It's going to be awesome. And things are looking up for sure. I, I'm going to... I'll probably work on this. I might... I still have to figure out what I want to do with that. I mean, I I, have, I know what I want to do. I just It's going to be a lot of work. I just went on a huge uh, little strip mine adventure, and I came back with 39 diamonds. Well, I had 39. I uh, enchanted another pickaxe, which is extremely crappy. Only efficiency 3. Very bad. So, I think we can get started working on what I want to do for this farm uh, this episode, but it might, it honestly, I feel like it might take a couple, I, like, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna work on it completely all at once, I think I'm gonna come back to it here and there, uh, just because it's gonna take a while, how, like, what I want, um, so I think I wanna completely get rid of this, we're gonna completely get rid of this farm right now, uh, and basically, let me try to explain what I wanna do. So, I want to have, like, different rooms in here. I want to have, you walk in, there's a wall right here, probably, like, starting, like, right here, right? And then just different sections with different rooms. Uh, so, you know, there's a door, you open it there's, with glass, obviously, so you can see what's in there. The wheat for the first one, you open it up, you go inside the wheat farm. With the wall, 
that leads to over in the next room over to the next farm and whatnot. So that's what I'm planning on doing. So, like I said, the wall is probably gonna. I don't have any spruce wood. <laughs> uh, let me see if I can. So basically, like starting right there, and then door coming into the farm. Now, and it's gonna expand. Or it's gonna keep going down that way. I think it's not gonna run into anything. Hopefully, I don't think it should. Uh, and that's the plan. What I how I how I plan on doing this right now. Uh, but like I said, it's going to take a while to do because I need to... I, I don't even have potatoes, carrots. I can get sugarcane anywhere. But the first run I'm going to do is my wheat farm. And each of these... Each of the sides of the farms are probably going to be different as well. Uh, the wheat, I feel like, should be the bigger... The more bigger one. The bigger one because uh, I need it for feeding animals and whatnot. Need dirt, so that's the plan. Hopefully, I I uh, I what am I? <laughs> Hopefully, I explained it enough. Jeez, I couldn't think of the word <laughs> to where you guys can see where I'm going at, what I'm gonna be doing, how I'm gonna be going at this. I need to get more spruce wood. Is the thing, and that takes a while. So I think I'm gonna have to make. I feel like I should enchant my my axe for one, uh, and I need to plant more than one tr big tree. I think I have saplings. I should. I have five. I better have more than five. I do. I okay. I have a ton. All right, good. So let's sleep really quickly. Oh, by the way, there's a banner above my bed. I killed a, uh, a raid right here. Oh no, I left this there. Wait, what? Oh, I did leave this there. Dang it. I forgot. I did. I was like... Look, I have the little buff at the uh, the top right, too. Uh, but yeah, I killed a raid captain. So I have to make another one of these. By the way, if you don't know what this is, why I have it up in the air. Because when you grow a big uh, spruce tree, it puts down potzel, like, all over the ground. And I hate dealing with that, so I make a little platform to grow it on. Uh, so I don't have to keep on replacing the grass. Is that it? Okay, that's it. Let's go this way. Okay. There is a second tree. Let's get this one planted. I'm spruce wood is like the the number one thing I'm using in uh, my base for this base, anyways. So I need a lot of spruce wood, so let's just get three trees. Three trees should be enough. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Five. I mean, honestly, it doesn't even need to be this big. Or it doesn't even need to be the same size. I don't know why I counted, but just to make it look a little bit better, I guess. <laughs> All right, there we go. We have trees planted. Cool, cool, cool. Um, I'm going to get start working on the, uh, the, the, the farm, the wheat farm. Just to show you guys what, you know, how, a little idea of how it's going to look. And then we're probably going to end up the episode. Alright, so here's a little bit of how I'm going to be setting it up. Um, just as I mentioned it, how we're, there's going to be a little divider, windows. When you come in, this will be the first farm, the wheat farm. Uh, I might make it a little bit bigger on each side. Maybe two more that way, two more that way. And then uh, back a lot, actually. Maybe like another ten blocks. And then once that's done, we'll put a wall down, continue this going down, put another room. Potatoes, put another room. Carrots, put another room. Sugarcane. That's how these farms are going to go. Um, I like how this is looking, by the way. So, that is the plan. I think that's going to be it for this episode, though, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like down below. I really appreciate it. If you guys are new to the channel, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.